When it comes to containers, it can be a jungle out there. But with a little planning and some investment, containers deliver a big payoff. Just keep these design ideas in mind. Containers should complement the style of your home and the appearance of the plants you intend to plant them with. Consider colors and textures. Our shady garden, for example, looked great with light colored containers. Their shapes, their sizes, their textures added variety, but that consistent color tone, that's what gave the garden unity. You can use containers to fill in blank spaces, or cover up utilities, or even create barriers. Fiberglass containers are lightweight and they're really long lasting. They're a great choice for those larger plantings. Try layering your containers. Choose plants in different sizes and complementary colors for height, for fill, and for spill. Just make sure they have similar needs for sun and water. Succulents make great container plants. They're slow growing, they're low water, they're heat tolerant, and they look beautiful all year round. Containers don't have to be expensive. Look around your house and use your imagination. If it's waterproof and you can drill a hole in it, you can plant it. Would you mind closing that for me? Thanks, Clay. You're welcome. I've got my next project, so I'm off to the nursery. And I'll see you next time on A Growing Passion. See more stories, tips, and techniques at our website, agrowingpassion.com.